one of the most dangerous competitors the women's division has ever seen, EO Sky. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, representing Damage Control from Tokyo, Japan, EO Sky! Whether it was Japan, Mexico, or WWE, EO's dominated wherever she's competed. EO Sky's become more powerful as a member of Damage Control and became an eliminator for the group. And they, in turn, have raised her to the level of Miss Money in the Bank and the WWE Women's Championship. A woman who can take out all competitors from the air, but is more than happy to break the rules as a backup plan. And utilizing both strategies has quickly made her one of the top competitors in the women's division. The consummate underdog of the women's division, Zelina Vega. And her partner, representing the LWO from Queens, New York, Zelina Vega. Zelina, one of the smallest competitors with the biggest heart. Yeah, now Zelina is sitting under the learning tree of Rey Mysterio and the rest of the LWO. Zelina really has a chance to break out even further. Zelina looking to make the LWO and her family proud tonight. Straight out of Sin City, she is one to watch in WWE. Yeah, a powerhouse threat in the women's division. And from Las Vegas, Nevada, the WWE Women's Champion, Zoe Stark! You know, Stark has had plenty of championship gold in NXT, but did not miss a step when joining the main roster and continuing her dominance on the biggest stages. And that's because Zoe has the attitude you need to be a success in WWE. Gentlemen, pay respects to your double champion. I already am. Well, double your respects then. And from Glen Ridge, New Jersey, one half of the NXT Women's Tag Team Champions and one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions. She fought with every ounce of her being, and the two titles she's carrying are proof of that. Proof of every ounce of fight she has in her being. Proof she's twice as good as everyone else. The WWE Universe is still buzzing about the double champ. I can't say I blame them. Hey, it's not easy carrying two championships everywhere you go. How do you do it, Byron? You're both the baldest and the lamest. Oh, pop. stop, Corey. That's not funny at all. And here we go with this tag team matchup. Getting this matchup underway, we have EO Sky and Zelina Vega. And they'll have their work cooperating cut out for them here, dealing with Zoe Stark and Katana Chance. Both sides in this match know that tag team competition is a very specific, very unique art form. We're going to see just who will be the better team here tonight. Left by the turnbuckles. Oh, kick right to the gut. Ooh, pounding the breadbasket. Nice counter from Chance. She's fighting back. Jumping clothesline in the corner. Finds its target. Ooh -hoo.
Double leg takedown. Stop! And she's thinking of recovering now. Still time to run away if she wants to. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Yeah. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. Face full of turnbuckle. Uh-oh. And Io gets pounced on. Whoa! Cross body. Turning the tables. Places are right in the corner. To cut Katana even further down to size. And EO calculated that offense perfectly. This could be bad. Ooh. Oh, God. And she goes for the pin. She... Oh! What, what the world? That's not good. This is going to turn into a two-on-one handicap affair, I believe. So much for teamwork making the dream work. Come on, Cole. The only person that believes that nonsense is Saxton. Well, I did believe it until a few seconds ago. Boom! What an uppercut! Constant pressure being kept on Zoe. Zoe has to wake herself up and turn her intensity up a notch. Delivering nasty stops. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. These will keep you down. And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Absolutely brutal. Ruthless. You want to control the tempo, you want to dictate the pace, that right there is how you do it. Oh, corkscrew neck breaker! Big form! The fatigue is setting in for her. Starts fighting spirit, shine through on that attack. Oh, Crossbody wipes them out. Goes into the pin. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Clearly, she's still got a lot of fight left in her. Comes in off the tag. The vendetta between these superstars has become so bitter that I'm almost afraid of what will happen here. Anything is possible when a rivalry gets this out of hand. Hopefully this is a chance for them to work through at least some of that pent-up aggression. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. Yo looking for a submission face first. The Koji clutch is locked in. Ah, save just in a nick of time. No. <laughs> Into the cover. She did it. She picked up the victory. Here is your winner. Overcoming the odds might be the sweetest taste of victory. Not losing focus and taking care of business. Tremendous. Absolutely, guys. Didn't think it was going to end this way. Even though they got the win, I don't know if this rift...
Listen, these two have a long history of not liking each other. Look at this stare down between these competitors who are at the top of their game. The official showing a little bravery by stepping between these two. Now it's time to go. I can only wonder what those two are saying to each other. What? Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara. Trying to find a way out. And he's out and delivers a knee. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. What's coming here? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Call the ambulance. Carry and Cross just toying with the crowd now, too. Bam! Ooh! Uh-oh, hazardous part of town here on the apron. Nasty! The hardest part of the ring. That was worse than being hit by a cinder block. And Wes is one step quicker. Under lights! Oh, well, they clutch their opponents rested. Look at this. And this is just next level brutality. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Goodness gracious. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of a submission here? Oh. Hold on. Trying to maneuver out. Dropping bombs right now. And escapes. That's a forearm that'll floor you. If Karrion Cross wants to come away with a win, he needs to take a methodical approach. Focus on taking his opponent. Picks the leg. Looking for the ankle lock submission. The ankle lock. The ankle lock is in! There's no escape! Oh, hold on! Maybe there is! Compromised position here. Close! He can end it here. He narrowly avoids the count. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close! Wrist clutch applied. And now a series of stomps and kicks. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. Striking at will. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. Hands outside, count outs legal in this match. Kick to the gut creates separation. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. And a basement drop kick. And landing with the double axe handle. Cross's mission got put on hold by that attack. West looked special right there. DDT spiked. Come on. No one likes a count out. Wesley is just begging for a fight. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. And Wes is really dialed in right now. Cross on the wrong side of every exchange. Canadian destroyer. into the pin. Two count, kick out, just in time. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. Taking flight. Oh, Wes with a big time move. Definitely some hard feelings between them. Yes, yeah, Saxton, but I don't think this has quite reached that boiling point yet. Makes the cover. The elation of victory. And a hard fought one at that. Now, what an emotional match. You cannot say enough about the performance of this man here tonight. 
to battle one of his toughest opponents and come out with a victory. You can see the heartbreak and the disappointment on the face of the loser, but wait a second. Well, a clenched fist, at least momentarily. It appears he changed his mind. It's a good thing, too. Please sit down, Byron. Please I can't help sit down. It. I got a goosebump parade running up and down my body. The new day's here. A goosebump parade. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the new day from Tampa, Florida. Weighing in at 285. Three very successful competitors, but even better as a group. Kofi Kingston, a world champion. Big E won Money in the Bank and the WWE title. And let's not forget King Woods. And Corey, all of that success is a testament to the power of positivity. He's a true alpha male. Braun Breaker, ready to dominate. And his opponent from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds, Braun Breaker! Absolute power, absolute aggression. This kid's the real deal. I agree, Cole. He's already more than living up to his family pedigree. I certainly hope this gentleman brought his heavy artillery tonight. Otherwise, Big E is going to beat his ass. Or Derriere. a simple and solid mentality when it comes to in-ring competition. He's here to break his opponent in half and then move on to the next obstacle in his path. Breaker's appetite for competition and his desire to take on bigger and badder opponents does seem insatiable. 
Every time he gets in the ring, he battles like he has something to prove. And it's that drive that has allowed Breaker to smash through practically anyone who has stood in his way over the course of his career. And staring him down is Big E, a man who I've said has all the tools a superstar needs to be at the top of WWE. Big E just needs to keep his focus on being an aggressor, being brutal, being the powerhouse that he truly is. I don't completely disagree with you, Corey. Big E should try to assert that. He can do it here. He's on the ropes. The official sees that it waves off the pen. Uh-oh. Oh, Big E avoids contact. Oh, loving blow to the chest. Military press. Ooh. And Big E falls to a counter. Oh, soon we could be... Body breaks free, but will the damage prove to be irreparable? Close line attempt. Into the STO. Corey Braun Breaker has been one of the most dominant young superstars in this business since the moment he first laced up his... Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. one way to get out of it. I can't believe it. we just saw a human. And will this be it? Digging, digging deep for the kick out. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. To the back of the neck. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. Crushing the knee there. Big E couldn't power his way through that attack. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Oh, and Breaker turns the tables. Ooh. Ron Breaker looking for old faithful. The starter recliner is locked in. An extreme amount of pressure. And watch this. Letting him free? Had him where he wanted him, but maybe he has something better planned. Uh-oh. Able to parry that one. Up and around and down. Being carried around with ease. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. with a punch. Slugging it out, toe to toe now. Ooh, slugging away with everything they've got. Two Titans trading strikes and refusing to back down. Two fighters putting their haymakers on autopilot right now. You can feel the contact and so does the WWE Universe. Exhaustion setting in and neither one of them is letting up. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. Ooh. Oh. Fist after fist, neither one relenting here. Pretty here, just good old fashioned fisticuffs. Big shots being fired right now. Neither competitor letting up. What impressive determination from both competitors. Keeping at each other no matter what. Who will break first? That is the question. The willpower, the sheer guts of these two. Braun Breaker, and the rope save him there. But will he be able to last much longer? Hold on a second, could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. You gotta take him a quick count. Wait a minute, there it is. That's a counter with style. Big boom. Pure natural.
natural ability. Oh, he's been late for the whole time. No stops the count at two. And you got to think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Vicious right forearm. on this loss. Maybe go back to the drawing board to figure out what went wrong. Um, hey, Michael, would you please shoot? <laughs> you know, I've had a lot of embarrassing things happen to me in my career. That may have been the most embarrassing thing ever, Saxton. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on their way to the ring at a combined weight of 532 pounds. Chad Gable and Otis, the Empire. You know, Alpha Academy may look like a bunch of oddballs, but they're legit. I wouldn't be surprised if they're really an accredited academy. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly competitive. They certainly think so. I mean, Alpha Academy is thinking that by the end of the night, we'll all be saying thank you. No, no, Saxton, like this. Uh, thank you. Oh, 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 good tip. Thank, Byron. Thank you, you, thank you. You just flunked out of the academy. Good news, everybody. The pit has just opened up. Ready to rock out and fight. And their opponents at a combined weight of 488 pounds. The WWE Mosh and Thrasher, the Headbangers. These guys set the stage for the Attitude Era. That's well, because the ring is their mosh pit, and tonight they're ready to break some faces.
One of the most unorthodox teams we've seen in the WWE. The Headbangers looking for a big win here tonight. You gotta love the energy these guys bring into the ring. Moss and Thrasher are full throttle from bell to bell, and that's not easy to keep up with in the ring. Yeah, Byron, we'll see if their chaotic frenzy is enough in this matchup. And then you have a team that is all about being the pinnacle of competition, the Alpha Academy. They have everything to lose, and they compete with that in mind every time the bell rings. Like it or not, they always climb into the ring primed to prove themselves to the competition and the WWE Universe. Sometimes that can really give them an edge. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Sharp clothesline. Now he's been forced to take a breather. That last sequence didn't go as he planned. In control here with a swinging neckbreaker. Textbook. What a barrage of stops. A proverbial mud hole has been stopped, and now it's time to walk it dry. There he goes, right into the corner. Elbow drop. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Oh, what a strike to the back. And the attack from Otis avoided. In control here with a swinging neckbreaker. Textbook. So much for leveling up. Otis got it taken to him there. Thrasher held nothing back on that attack. And he gets the tag. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Oof. Into the corner now. That'll stop you in your tracks. Retaliation from Thrasher. We know what's coming next. What more can be done at this point? The better part of Valor. Oh. Springboard! He's turning the tables. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. Shot to the back of the neck. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. From behind, back suplex. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. Scouted. Run down with a snap bear. Here's the cover. No, he kicks out. That's still a quick kick out at this point. Strike connects. That puts a stop to Gable. He could pin his opponent right here. Dying a two count there. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. He went right into that turnbuckle. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. He is just reeling from that offense. And yeah, it's about time to heavily consider tagging in that partner. Oh, 
my gosh, that's gross. That's how you unleash brutality. Find the animal in you. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Oh, look at this. This is gonna be nasty. It's further into the... He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. And he makes the save for his team. Tagging his partner in now. Stiff headbutt. Here's a cover. Could be it. Oh, barely kicks out. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. That's yours in your head. Put into the corner now. Two do it so well together. He's expressing pain now. He can really stand to get back as good as he's getting right about now. Tag is made, and here we go. Elbow drop. Piercing. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Oh. Moss feeling a sense of confidence here. Catches the kick. Dragon screw. Rolling into a monkey flip. He got whipped into that corner. Oh, what's going to happen here? Look out. To the one. If that won't beat him, I'm not sure anything will. Headlock. Oh, a cheap shot right above the eye. Retaliation from Thrasher. From the first row. Mosh is real. In real danger now. Uh oh Finds the room to land a back elbow. Push! And Gable experiencing a true show of force there. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? He made the tag. Cooking with gas now. Sometimes in the middle of a hard-fought match, you need a snack. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Oh, the apron! The hardest part of the ring. Oh, strong impact! with a crucial elbow. They need to be aware of a count out right now. And he slides him back to the mat. Whoa. And Moss's confidence was just kept in check. Yeah, it looked like the Alpha Academy curriculum worked out. We're reaching a point where these superstars must be. That should do it right there. Kicks out before the two count. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Blow to the abdomen gets them out of that. Getting set up for something in the corner.
saw that one coming. Huge toss. And Thrasher moves. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Harsh right hand. Second rose line. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. This their opponent's oh, legs. Oh. Is, that's a free fall. They've got their opponent on his hand. This maniac's out of control. Uh oh That unraveled on Thrasher. Thrasher wasting no motion on the counter. Catches the kick. Oh, wow. Tackles ruthless. Tag was made. Tag made. Double team coming. Drop down, clothesline. Otis has been roughed up pretty hard here. Holding on by a thread, maybe even less at this point. Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal form. And a tag there. is starting to rock. Yes, tag! Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. Hooked up, and DDT! Boom! He had it scouted. Oh, that's that's a line. It's cinched in, this could be over. Submission locked in. They're gonna free the arm and does just that. Shoulder tackle. Into the corner. This can't be good. Time to go for a ride. On oh, exploder suplex. Across the top rope. Ooh, what a hot shot. Looking to take flight here. From the top. What? Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. In complete control of their opponent here. Boom! Into a DDT. Gable's fixed on him now. Arm ringer. Well, that changed. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Whip back into the ring. He beats the count, and this one continues. And slamming their face down. The energy in here is palpable. Something truly special is unfolding before our eyes. Closed fist connects. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh my gosh, that's gross. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. No mercy being shown to Gable here. Thrasher showing that on the top. Moves off from Thrasher. For the win. Hey, wait, 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 wait. How can that be fair? Come on, ref. Keep these guys in check. Drop kick. 
Pinning down their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Tagged in. Avoiding the clothesline. Flatliner! With the Lariat. a punch to the face. Look at this, going counter for counter. Larian. And Otis showing their stick. Wait, 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 wait. No, he gets the shoulder up. How in the world did he kick it out? This crowd is thunderous right now. Who can blame them? Moss muscling up his opponent into the burning him. Does that finish Otis off? Oh, come on, ref, get some control. Shut up, Byron. Getting him into the corner. Bash with a punch to the gun. Punch to the stomach connects. in mind from Thrasher. Here we go. He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. All the way up. Still up. Squatting to my gosh. Wow. Back and forth from these competitors. Missed the clothesline. Flatliner connects. Oh, treading all over their opponent. Just cranking the head. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Oh, uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. Slam hard on the apron. Time to get back in the ring. Cut. Will it be? And he makes the save for his team. <sighs> Sent into the corner. Here we go. Start the count. Any more punches and Saxon's going to have to take his shoes off the count. Right hand for the second rose line. There's the tab, which means some tandem offense is on the horizon with both of these competitors. Oh, we're about to up the ante here. Nice leg drop into a power bomb. Rasher might have clinched it there. Cover. Such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here are your winners. Marsh and Thrasher, the Thin Bangers. And not exactly the result the Alpha Academy wanted tonight. I'm sure Gable has an excuse already. Gives you hope for the future of the tag division. Great tag team action on display, guys.
an impressive young talent. And we know that impressive young talent, Nathan Fraser, sure knows how to soar. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Jersey, the Channel Islands. Weighing in at 182 pounds, Nathan Fraser! Oh, believe it or not, Nathan Fraser was actually trained by Seth freaking Rollins. Perhaps the most prized pupil of the visionary. Well, that training's apparent from Nathan Fraser's innovative style and offense. Maintains a devil may care attitude towards any opponent. High flying, high risk, high reward, all too familiar for Nathan Frazier. Well, hopefully, Nathan learned a lesson or two from Icarus. First tour of duty and uh oh no! What a malicious attack! This is about getting the edge, not making friends, Saxton. And the referee for this match is motioning to the superstars, saying they need to get into the ring. Yeah, trying to steer this. Hoping to end it early. Well placed kick. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. He's one step ahead there. And Punk gets countered there. Inverted face lock. Driven down with an elbow to the heart. CM Punk refers to himself as the best in the world, which some might consider overconfidence. Can that sort of mindset come back and bite him in this one? Not at all. That confidence is one of the main things that has made Punk so successful in all of his endeavors. When you know you're the best, you're going to give it your best every time you step into that ring. And that looked like a terrible landing. That might have caused some serious issues. We'll have to see what happens. And now gets tossed into the ring. Referee signals to the bell, and we are finally underway. These superstars are seeing red right now, gentlemen. Crank in the head. A show of disrespect from Frazier. Ooh. Wow, breathtaking standing shooting star. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Side Russian leg sweep. He moved, but can he capitalize? Things now not going well for CM Punk. Punk needs to reformulate a strategy. You know, I've noticed some friction lately between these superstars. Well, you can't be friends with everybody. I've noticed the same. There's definitely something of a rivalry here. Oh! Short on clothesline by Punk. Taking full crash landing. A well-timed dodge. Oh, what a man. It's incredible, the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. He's been placed in the corner now. It's a hurry. He's absorbed. Here he goes for the win. He gets the shoulder up at two. And frustration might be starting to set in. Oh, look at this agility. Springboard moonsault. Not done yet. He may get the three count right here. This is it. Breaks the count. So, so close. That could have been it. Able to reverse. Oh, stomping away. We got a cover. He got the shoulder up in time. 
Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. So precise with the super kick. Punk wasting no motion on the counter. Opponent set up with a tree of woe, driving those knees. Get in there, ref. to win. Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. Oh, looking to triple the leg. Guys, they're getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. He turns it around. Inverted face lock. Driven down with an elbow to the heart. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Get back here. Leg Lariat. Mention of Gooch. Absolutely planted. The end is looming now. He if this lands, it's over. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. Stops the count. The life left in Nathan might be out. Oh, that gets reversed on CM Punk. Side Russian leg sweep. This is turning into an all-out battle. No holding back. Frazier up top. Frog splash from Nathan Frazier. Is it enough? Celebrate all night long. Here is your winner, Nathan Razor. A bitter loss in this one for CM Punk. A blow to Punk's ego for sure, but he's never stayed down or out for long, though. The Vikings have arrived. Summoned from Valhalla, they are ready for battle. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. Making their way to the ring at a combined weight of 552 pounds. The NXT Tag Team Champions, Ivar. The raid has begun! The modern-day Vikings are here to pillage the competition. Looking hungry tonight. Hungry and scary.
Imperium has arrived. A united group with one unwavering mission to prove that the mat is sacred. And their opponents at a combined weight of 440 pounds, the Raw Tag Team Champions, Giovanni Benci and Ludwig Kaiser, Imperium! Well, Imperium clearly are not here to have fun, but you have to respect their mission statement of the mat being sacred. Oh, I do, but I've seen your matches, Saxton, and you do not respect their mission statement. Have you seen my matches? I definitely consider the match sacred. Oh, my gosh. He's undefeated. We are moments away from seeing Imperium's mission statement in action. And that's unfortunate for anyone else in the ring. Action has made it back to the ring and we can officially start this match. Oh man. Yeah, the refs got their hands full in this one. Ow. Oh! Getting tossed! It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Looking wobbly in the corner. Oh my, what a splash! The sheer force of that landing was probably enough to fracture a few bones. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Great reaction from Ibar. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Boom, right in the button. Carefully measured. Oh, man! Leg drop arm breaker. And he goes for the pin. Just kicks out. Somehow, some way. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. In the corner. Payne must be shooting through that leg now. He deflects it right back. To the knee. Clean tag for his partner. Oh, the knee just being torn apart now. Oh, what a knee. Counter. And now there's an opening. Oh, look at this. Raining right hand. Not stop close. Oh man. Right on target with a stop to the gut. Mistake made by Ivar. And scissors Ooh. take that. Oh, very nice. Chop lock. Tossed into the corner. 
torturous focus on the leg. Ooh. Tendons and ligaments in the leg can be easily damaged by that. Short arm clothesline. Setting up for something here. Snake eyes! Good night. And now this is the right move. Get out of dodge and collect yourself. Oh, short. Cover, cover. No, shoulders up at two. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Incoming. Crash landing. Power bomb. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. I think they've made it obvious that this is far from over here, guys. Yeah, Corey, I just hope this gets resolved before someone gets seriously injured. Uh-oh. Eric fires back. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Great wherewithal on the counter. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. Laying into the arm, big time. Elbow finds the mark. Elbow after elbow. Down they go. Gets the tag. Big forearm. Ah, oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Half kick right on point. That aggressive style the Viking Raiders being met in kind there. Yeah, Giovanni delivering the pain. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. And set right into the corner. And a hammer fist right across the collarbone. Broken up with a fist to the face. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. In the corner. Fighting back with a counter. All right, pump handle. Pump handle coming. Boom. Incredible suplex. Now trampling the opposition. Reaches his partner for the tag. Serious trouble here and finds his way out. A powerful suplex toss. Whoa. Buster. Right to the gut. Off. Four just raking right across the face. Dangerous position here, guys. Oh, no, no, no. Back no. suplex. Ooh. Boom. Oh. And that stops whatever Kaiser intended. Springboard. Oh, that was scary power. Squaring off right by our announce table.
Locks in the gut wrench. All the way up and boom! And the the gut buster. Absorbing that hit probably left Finchie's ego a little bruised. An attack from the Viking Raiders that would make Odin proud. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh, uncorked. Tag made. Double team headed our way. Look at this power all the way up. Around the rock. Vinci's down, and he might be out. Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? These men have given everything they have and more at this point. This is a critical moment now to see who can find a way to keep going. Inverted DDT connects. Sorry, European uppercut. Ooh, merciless looking blood. He skirts away, living to fight another day. Oh, 
my! What a display of dominance. Vertical suplex into a powerbomb. Vinci. Spinning sit-out powerbomb. Ivar's in big, big trouble. Oh, look at this. Out to the Whoa. apron. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Back suplex. Spine crushing. The entire WWE Whoa. Universe is on their feet. An absolute barn burner. What is he going to do here? DDT. Great reaction from Ibar. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Oh, what a right hand. Oh, my God. And they score the win. What a tag match. It wasn't Here the higher are. distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. Eric the Viking Raiders. The out of the ring count getting the best of them tonight. The winner looks a bit let down that this is the way the match ended. Perhaps they should have tried to break the count at the end there. Here comes Sami Zayn. Underdog no more. He has reached main event status. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Weighing in at 212 pounds. Perhaps no superstar with more heart in WWE than Sami Zayn. You can beat him down, kick him around over and over again, but Sami will always get back up. The WWE Universe is on their feet for Sami Zayn. Well, here comes the Scottish warrior. Carrying his trusted blade, Angela, McIntyre summons the support of the WWE Universe into battle. Sword or 
no sword, Drew McIntyre is a dangerous, dangerous man. McIntyre is as physical as it gets. He is not afraid to get down in the dirt or throw hands. Defiant, bold, Drew McIntyre bows to no man. He is as in your face as they come. A mass of man ready to go to war. has the physique that's carved out of marble. Yeah, Michael, when you look at Bobby Lashley, you see an absolute freak of nature. And it is almost impossible to stop this runaway train. For nearly two decades, Lashley has been pure and total dominance personified. He's at the top of the food chain and won't let anyone forget it. One of the UK's best exports. And from Dudley, England, weighing in at 175 pounds, Tyler Bates! This is a man who captured the NXT UK Championship as a teenager. Yeah, and he's only gotten better since. Same fighting spirit, but stronger and smarter than ever. Well, we have seen time and time again that Tyler Bate has plenty of heart. A pure will to win. It has allowed Bate to defeat much larger opponents. And there's no mountain Bate can't conquer with a little hard work and a little more mustache wax. Superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, this is the way we're starting, Carl. I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Power slam! Shifts it back onto him. Oh, no. Oh, no. This could end it all. The inverted Alabama slam. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. And a reversal by Tyler Bate. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Pummels the shoulder. Nice cross body. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Oh, come on, Cole. It's not about being sadistic. It's about being smart. There's no safety net in a no disqualification match, and that's a big factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. Elbow throw saying not today. Ah, oh, bear hugs. Bear hug. Well placed elbow. We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is. Nice side headlock applied. Oh, oh and a right hand for good measure. Punishing their opponent. Clubbing blows. Yeah. 
Ooh, point of the elbow counters that. Strong suplex. And into the count. No, he pops the shoulder before three. He's determined to keep this matchup going. He's lost some of his win now. Uh-oh. Cross the shoulders. Airway cross neck breaker. I think we'd see a kick out there. The countdown has been oh, He may get the three count right here. I think so. And he fights it off. He just won't give up. And look, he did beat. Sends the knee into the face. That'll stop you. Just a debilitating neck breaker. Vicious right forward for the victory here. That could have been it. Tyler B looking to lock it in. He breaks up the hole. Spirit might have wavered there a bit. That unraveled on Zane. Sitching in the hurt lock. No, oh, this one should have been over, but he breaks the hold. Tyler B looking to lock it in. Billy goes. He breaks the hold. Factor. 
And he gets delivered back into the ring. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Oh, what a clubbing blow. When you're in an atmosphere like this, where you can't hear yourself think because the crowd's so loud, you find a way to do Boom! Claymore delivered! That might be all Drew needs. Not the position you want to be in right now. Back into the ring. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Right on a kendo stick. Any connection with flesh will definitely leave a rope. And there's the cover. Three. No, no, no. The shoulders were not down. The referee was right on top of it. Able to avoid the ball there. Oh, jarring uppercut. Uh, Tyler Bent in well timed maneuver there. Thunder's club comes down. Very effective. Oh, just a straight deadlift. The power. It was of your seed ending to this fatal four-way. A top-to-bottom, action-packed match from all four men. Yeah, these guys really put on a barn burner. He looks great with all that gold on him. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing in at 220 pounds. The undisputed 
I can't imagine the amount of pressure he's feeling carrying around two championships. Yeah, the pressure is on when you have one title, but with two, it has to be immense. This man will not let either of those titles out of his grasp. A determined look on the face of the double champion. The king of strong style. Ready to deliver big hits and get the big win. That's the only way he knows how. And his opponent from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220. taking in the totally unique style and attitude of Shinsuke Nakamura. A man who does what he wants, who lives his life his way. Doesn't hesitate to punish those who cross his path. Well, don't come between Shinsuke and his goals. Simple as that. He must be prepared for battle against one of the toughest competitors in all of sports entertainment. And if he is, it'll be one of the most memorable moments in his entire career. And now this match is officially begun. I'm not even sure the word official is in their vocabulary at this point. I think you're right, Saxton, and I love it. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Using the ropes. And an inverted atomic drop. Single leg takedown of their opponent, and there it is. It's tough. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Boom. Oh, across the top rope. This could be big. Going up. From the top, whoa, look out. What a reckless attack. Off the top rope, putting it all on the line. Which of Cody's skills do you think will come to bear tonight? In his time away from WWE, Cody has become a next level brawler. And honestly, that might be his best bet here. Just get down and dirty with the competition. Don't back down. Remind them he's the son of a son of a plumber. Crank in the head. Cody Toit. Oh, he grew tired of his smug attitude. Cody Rhodes felt that coming. What a springboard attack. Figure four. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. 
This is agonizing. Tough position to be caught in here. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh. Measured stomp right to the gut. Oh, and then the chest as well. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Getting carried around, bad spot to be in. Oh, Ram face first. Can he score the pin? Oh, maybe. Oh, somehow. He's still in this. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. German suplex. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. Delivering elbow after elbow. Yeah. Oh, Nakamura! The landslide! Just think about the artistry of what we just witnessed from Nakamura. Nothing but fortune and glory lie ahead for a man of his talents. And he'll do anything to ensure that's the case. Bam! Springboard roundhouse. Good night. Vicious right forearm. He's starting to struggle here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Placing them into the corner. Oh, he knew what was coming. A familiar, gruesome sight on the face of the American Nightmare. The top of that turnbuckle is not where you want it. Both superstars perched up high. Not for the night. Cody for the crossroads. Rhodes just turned the lights out. Two. No, he beats the count. How? How did Shinsuke kick out of that? You gotta wonder what more Cody has to do to put him away here. Crank in the head. Nakamura might need to find a reprieve. And Cody's next level brawling skills on display right now as he takes it to the opposition. Shinsuke is being carefully measured now. Shinsuke Nakamura with a nice shot. Cody's eyes look great. And a kick out. The resilience on display from Cody Rhodes is a common occurrence that never gets old. But you can rest assured, guys, Shinsuke Nakamura will not take his eyes off the prize after that kick out. Insulting. This fight has to be seen to be believed. Who will prevail? True greats are at their best when their backs are against the wall. Nakamura sizing him up from the top. Perched up top. Shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Scouting pays off against Nakamura. Springboard up. And concern being shown across Shinsuke's face at this point. Not everything's gone to plan for Cody, but he still has a chance to finish the job. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. He eludes the contact. Lives to fight another day. Rhodes letting his opponent know who's in charge. The WWE Universe has come alive in this one. They are up and they are vocal. A lot of energy in the room. And that was a precisely measured attack. Way to steer clear. Oh, uh, what a knee left. Ooh.
This is insanity. Did you expect anything less? Oh, a well placed D drop in the skull. Shot after shot. Oh, ruthless striking. Rolling into a monkey flip. Oh, counters right into the bread basket. Cody looking to end this. And this could do it. Crossroads. Cody Rhodes just might have finished things. The cover. up the W. Here is your winner, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. Big time victory for Cody Rhodes. Well, as cutting as Nakamura's knee strikes can be, they just weren't sharp enough tonight. That's pretty surprising. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. The Judgment Day is here. Everyone in their way is doomed. The Judgment Day growing more dominant every single night, and their accolades grow with every match. Now, this is a group that's almost impossible to prepare for. The Judgment Day plans for every scenario, always having each other's back. Well, they create chaos, and Judgment Day thrives in chaos. Just look at the Judgment Day. Powerful, dominant, 
and ready to unleash their anger. Expect no mercy, no concern for their opponent's well-being. Well, that's how the Judgment Day conducts their business. They want power at any cost. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 501 pounds, Solo Sikoa and Jimmy Uso. And their opponents at a combined weight of 439 pounds. The SmackDown Tag Team Champions and the NXT Tag Team Champions, Finn Balor and Damian Priest, the Judgment. Here we go, gentlemen. The tag team titles are up for grabs. Final preparations between partners before the action begins. has made it back to the ring and we can officially start this match. Oh, man. Yeah, the refs got their hands full in this one. Tag is registered. Oh, Averting danger with an elbow to the stomach. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Added momentum from the ropes. That's like getting hit by a charging bull. Smash. Oh, kick right to the back. Priest gets countered. Quick thinking pays off. Ah, oh, face first off the post. Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. The challenger eating up some damage. Priest dished out severe punishment, and his opponent is feeling the effects. Oh, running it. Here's a pin for the title. And the champion avoids the two count. He's not even close to being done yet. Oh, a stiff headbutt. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't going to be good. the top. Nobody home. Yeah, shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Only a one count before the kick out. An emphatic kick out, and there's still a lot of game left here. Getting him into the corner. Shoulder tackle after shoulder tackle. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, Alley -oop. oh my God. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm has the arm trapped. Oh, cover by the challenger. Gets the shoulder up in one. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. And full control here, face first in the turnbuckle. The champ now absorbing a little damage. Intense offense, as always, from the enforcer. Super kick! Whoa! 
look ringside now, guys. This manager is doing something very suspicious. Boom! Now, this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Using the forearm to their advantage. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Cover by the champ. He keeps his team in the match. he think he's going? Look, he's just taking the perfect opportunity to regain some composure. Oh, look at the knees. Just unloading knees to the body. Showing absolutely no mercy at all. What an onslaught. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Taking off from the ropes. What an incredible display of athletics from the Colossus. He's looking to do some serious harm. Picking the competition apart. This is Uso's perseverance getting tested. Enough already. Uh oh. And Jimmy able to reverse that. Jimmy managing to get some control back now. The angry Uso looking for the upper hand. And a thunderous forearm to follow. Oh, right to the jaw. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah. Here we go. My goodness, that'll stop anyone. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Kick. Right in the spot. Now a pin for the championship. Kicks out. Almost inhuman at this point. Big forearm. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Setting it up. Look at this inverted figure four. Tap, tap. Uh, pressing their foot right into the gut. That's got to hurt. Tagged in. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. To cross the top rope. Stiff headbutt. Heading up, he's thinking big. From the top. Out. That is just pure instinct at this point. Tag made. Tag made. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Zakoa gets out of dodge. Drop kick to the knee. Back elbow completely cuts them off. Close line. Tag made here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Gonna see a new champ. Cover. Oh, that was close. This match continues. Look at this. Just unloading. And a cover for the championship. Kick out just before two. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? Ripping at the eyes. He catches Jimmy with a counter. Oh, what a super kick, a double super kick. Able to interrupt the attack. Look at this, snap suplex. We knew we were in 
looking for something special between these competitors, but they are taking things over their own limits. Now, uh, 1916. But champions need to finish the job. Near fall. Just barely able to kick out. I thought the champ had it in the bag. This is how much the championship means. You can see the sweat drip out of the challengers every pour. And you have to ask, will Bow remain undaunted towards the task at hand? The champ not looking great right now. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Ooh, that's a shoulders down. Championship on the line. He breaks the ref's count before two. This is where great cardio makes all the difference, helping you stay alive deep into the match. Oh, my goodness. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Just kicking the spine. <laughs> Priest has his opponent up. Clearly waiting for that. And I think, oh yeah, Priest is bleeding. The noise surging through this arena is ridiculous. It's the echoes of the universe witnessing a war. My God, enough! And the momentum's clearly against Priest now. Jimmy's proven hard to deal with. And just eating a knee on the reversal. The crowd is fired up. Priest is fired up. Powering their opponent up. Tombstone slam. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Just insulting. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. Oh, right in there. And he sends him into the corner. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. Just caught flush. That turns it around for Solo. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. Now this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Using the forearm to their advantage. Uh-oh. here. He made it. Tag made. Flying forearm connects. Oh, ouch. Great job anticipating Jimmy. Targeting the stomach to reverse that maneuver. By Hammerlock now. Into a lariat. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Jimmy backed into a wall now. Yeah, it's becoming a dangerous scene for Jimmy. Drop kick. What a forearm shiver. Oh, man. A uh, big kick to the gut. A clubbing forearm. Oh, uh, look at this. What a headbutt. He's tagging out. Time. Set up in the corner of the ring. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage. 
Jones here. of the challenger keeps this match going. You can just see how much this title means, how much one is willing to go to to claim themselves as the new champion. Oh, my, single leg drop kick. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is aggression, just pure brutality. Come on, easy. A malicious attack across the throat. He manages to escape it. There it is, the sling blade. Knife edge chop. Finn lining him up. Oh, almost through the turnbuckle. For the win to retain the championship. He keeps his team in the match. Sokoa prevents that from connecting. He got whipped into that corner. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. An impressive chain of moves from Balor. Sokoa needs to better assess the situation to turn this around. Not a single person in this place is sitting down. We might just be watching one of the greatest matches we've seen in quite some time here. What a shot! Underhanded face rake throws off the attack. Look at this. Boom, nice. Big sling blade. Followed up with a basement drop. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. He's got him scouted. Chop block without warning. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Now, this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Oh. Using the forearm to their advantage. Jimmy's looking helpless to every attack. Finn's proving hard to deal with. My God, enough! Jimmy manages to counter. And Jimmy puts a quick stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. Maybe Jimmy found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Shot in the face gets him out of that spot. And he gets set back into the ring. Targets the gut to end the offense. Snapmare takedown. Oh my, single leg drop kick. And Balor's looking determined. Jimmy here in a disheartening position. Elbow drop right on point. With a championship on the line. And the champion. Stay the champs. What a title defense. Here are your winners. And still, the SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Finn Balor and Damian Priest. The Judgment Day. Tag Team Chemistry in full effect with these two superstars. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice.